Okay. So, remember the other day we were talking about inertia? Yeah. An um, object that's in motion tends to stay in motion unless acted on by an outside force. Yeah. And an object at rest tends to stay at rest Ex unless acted on, on by an outside force. Yeah, so, I got it. this is the flywheel, remember? Yes, it spins. Okay, well, this is what it does. See, it's still moving. So what this happened, what's this, what's this? It's, blah. it's moving the piston. Well, well, well the piston, when, the, when, when the piston would have an explosion, it would push down and it would cause this to turn. And it would push up the next one. So there's a trade between a big flywheel that's a lot of weight, where you get a really smooth running engine, because bang, bang, it's bang. It's not focused. Well, back up. It's, it's fuzzy. Don't zoom it. It's... Don't zoom. I'm zooming back out. It's still fuzzy. Oh, okay. That's fine. Might just be because it's humid and whatnot in here. Or you can have a really, really light flywheel that doesn't smooth out your engine so much, but because, but if because it's light, you can accelerate it quicker. So race cars have a really, really light flywheel, just enough to keep the pistons going. But as soon as the guy romps on the gas, that thing's spinning fast, right? These old Ford trucks, these are actually tractor motors. These are the same motors they used in tractors. So they had a big flywheel because you so, throw it in so the gear to pull after, something. After you take this apart, you would know how to take apart a tractor engine? I, this is just like any other engine for the most part. The things are in different places, but any modern internal combustion piston engine, it works this way. I mean, even, even your mom's Volkswagen out there works the same way. There's, it's fancier, there's different things about it. But. You can't see it. So if you look here, you see that there's, if you look back here, I've taken two of the bolts out all the way, and these two... I can't see anything. Back up. You're too close. Okay, that's a little better. So I took out these two bolts. I left these two loose, and you can see these two pins in here. This thing's pressed onto these pins. So what I'm doing is I'm ringing it around to this side, and I'm you using took this... this starter out, yeah. But I'm using this starter bolt right here to run into the back of the flywheel and push it off because those are mashed down really tight. Now I've got to be careful with this. Is it this fall flywheel. On me? Well, that's why I got these two bolts in here still, so hopefully it doesn't fall on either of us. Because it weighs 60 pounds in this one. The flywheel. Just the flywheel. Just the flywheel weighs 60 pounds. Man, that's 28 more pounds, and that's what I weigh. Yeah, it's heavy. And I don't know how long it's going to take to get this off. Just a couple minutes, I think. But... Daddy. What, dear? No, because we're going over to Mr. Carl's house tonight. Oh. I'm just going to sit on the couch and read a book. That's fine. I'm tired of little kids today. I can imagine. You should bring some of that cheese it party mix. Oh, really? Yeah, we do. No, do? don't bring the party mix. Bring the white cheddar ones. We do. We have white cheddar Cheez-Its and we have party mix Cheez-Its. My hands are already dirty and I didn't touch anything. You're a kid. Your hands are always dirty. You gotta back it out every so often, because if you go too far, it'll you'll cause things to bind. But I think it's almost out. So why did you put that block of wood there? Because this wasn't at. Ah, uh, see that? Yeah. It just it, popped loose. It wasn't at this angle the other day. I got it because it was up underneath, and I couldn't turn this thing all the way around. So now. Please don't hurt yourself. I'll do my best. You know how that works sometimes. Where's the side wrench? Is there a fourth Okay, here we go. It weighs 
weighs less than Leah does. It weighs 60 pounds. Less than Leah does. There, that's the back of the flywheel. Woo! And now you see right here. The innards. This is the end of the crankshaft, and now it's, and this is the main bearings right here and the main seal. So right there's the main bearings, this is the main seal that oh, keeps, the glare. keeps oil and stuff from getting out. I don't know if we'll actually pull the crank out of this or not, just because it takes some extra doings because of the way it's sitting here. But there we go, that's it. And stop the filmer. It stopped already. No, it didn't. I don't think so.